Hello everyone, I'm Miafanon. Welcome to Emily Wants to Play 2. I'm going to be playing a lot of horror games on the channel, so if you want to see part 2 of this, let me know. But anyway, uh, let's just get started, I guess. That was a crazy party. I'm exhausted. Whoa. I'm so sleepy. So you got some pizza? That's neat. So yeah, I haven't played the first one on the channel, but I have played it myself. It was fun. Um, but, yeah. Yeah. What's this? Uh, calculator. Ah. Messy. Yeah, this place is pretty messy. Uh, I don't know how I feel about it being so messy, but, you know, messy. What was that? Waking up at 3 a.m. apparently. That is early. Dumb alarm. Dumb alarm indeed. Who are you? A flashlight. Why do I have a flashlight? There. Um. Okay. Um, can I stop that, please? Why is the shower green? Stop, please. Okay. That was unpleasant. So I'm showering. The water is kind of gross, but I'm using a lot of soap. You know, I don't think that's really how that works, but, you know... Do what you want, buddy. The box is gone. Uh, where did I put my car keys? That's a good question. I don't know. This way, maybe? That's my bedroom. And, oh. Uh... Mr. Tatters is right here. Uh... Who's that? Hello? Light? Oh. What? Um. Okay. Where did I put my car keys? I don't know. Okay, that doll is gone. Doesn't look like my car keys are in here, so I'm gonna head downstairs real quick, I think. He's gone, oh, let her in. Chester. He's right there, uh. Where are my car keys? Ah. Hello? Um. Can I turn that on, please? Why are there clocks? Yeah, it is 3 a.m. Glad of you to notice. What the frick was that? What was... What was that saying, Mama? Do the tasks and die. Uh, maybe I shouldn't get my car keys. I mean, I already did that. Choose wisely or fail. They're dice. They're numbered. What's this? In quotes, you must see the answers to know the answers. Okay. So this says three. Oh, wait, could this relate to the dice at all? It might. Here, let me go up and go see. What was it? Three? Oh. I got. 
clearance level one. What's that sound? <laughs> no. Why would I leave? Um. What's that? Oh, oh my god! What the heck? Oh. Oh. Jeez. Okay. It's one. Uh, one. Come on, come on, come on, come on. What? I... I don't have more to do, though. Oh! I can open that door. Oh, what? What? Okay, that's all I had to do. That's really loud. Oh, my God. I keep having that same nightmare. So it was a dream. So the doll's not here. Oh. My car keys. There's my flashlight. These books aren't here. None of this. Is weird. Except this house layout. I still don't get it. What is this picture though? Weird. I'm leaving for work. Right? Here we are. Um, anyone here? I, I have the sandwich order. I sound like a Hello? dork. Central evidence. Long-term evidence storage and research facility. What is that? What? What? Oh. So this is where he was and... Oh wait, that's the doll that we were doing. Can I pick up pictures? Uh, eyes removed before fire. What? Incident report. Incident house fire. A house located at the 781 Hill Park Drive burned to the ground in the middle of the night. None of the residents escaped. They were presumably sleeping. Cause of incident unknown. Description. The house itself and all the items in the home were burned be beyond recognition, except for a strange baby doll. The doll is rather large and the eyes have been removed. It seems to have taken some damage, but should have been burned up completely. In on its right foot is the word Greta. A young girl lived at the residence, and it is possibly her doll. The doll will be taken in as evidence. A fingerprint and chemical search should be performed to try and determine the cause of the fire. Greta. All found in ashes. Interesting. Shh. Okay, what's this? Findings on burnt baby doll from house fire incident. No fingerprints found, no flammable chemicals found. Doll constructed of a flame retardant material. Eyes were removed before fire. No further clues as to cause of house fire based on burnt doll. Greta, personal note, this thing is very quick. This thing is creepy. It was put back very quietly. So its eyes are gone. Does that mean it's blind? Oh, wait, a card. I have a key card. Neat. Wait, what's this? Mr. Tatters. To do. Tag Tatters. Is that a clue? That feels a little specific. Uh. 
Let's go this way, I guess. Oh. This place is big. Uh, I guess I can go here. Oh, it's 8 p.m. Or 8 a.m. I think that was... It's probably p.m. because it's night. Research Office 1. Okay. Research Office 1, here we go. Oh. What was that? Okay. In uh What is that? Incident. Department store robber found and killed in gunfire exchange with police. Cause of incident, male suspect Maxwell Steeles. Description, Maxwell Steeles had been robbing from multiple mall department stores over the last few months. He was apparently hiding in front of a gutted mannequin suit. He somehow snuck onto the main floor and hid among other mannequins. He would patiently wait for the store to close and all lights to shut off, then he would move around the store without being detected. Um. Oh. Hi. Are you gonna kill me? Oh. You're gonna clip through the wall. Okay, so yeah, she is blind. Then he would move around the store without being detected by ca alarms or cameras. He was never seen in the light on any recorded footage. He would steal various items, cash, and more from the store, refer to the multiple reports from each incident for more information. Tonight, uh, he tripped an alarm at the local mall. Police responded quick enough to catch him. He attempted an escape. Police fired upon him, killing him. Police thought he was armed, but no weapons were found. His mannequin outfit has been taken to evidence. Is you back, you're back. So this is him. Oh, that's who killed me in the first thing. And wasn't he? Yeah, he was sitting in that armchair, and he was uh, disappeared when I turned my flashlight on. Hello, mannequin. Maxwell steals his head guy. Maxwell steals mannequin outfit investigation report. The suit is a hollowed out plastic mannequin. Each limb is connected on the inside by special hinges. The hinges are very noisy. It is surprising Max wasn't heard during his robberies. The eyes include special filters that uh, that have night vision functionality. This would allow Max to see in the dark. The plastic suit has damage from multiple bullet entries and abrasions in multiple places. Personal note, the suit is scary, very lifelike, and has an awful smell. Being in the tar dark with this would be terrifying. A lot of this stuff is dark related so maybe light yeah 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 that would make sense because he disappeared when i turned my flashlight on so maybe he doesn't like light information regarding old box from mrs person's report the box appears to be a very old jack-in-the-box style toy the letters weasel were written on the inside bottom doesn't have any inner workings or gears doesn't appear functional inside was a small jester doll Brax's fingerprints were found on the outside of the box, but were also on the inside of the box, and the fingerprints were facing a strange way, as if Brax was grabbing from the inside of the box into the outer rims. Personal note, it made a noise once I got close to it. I'm not sure how. Hmm. Weasel. No, I don't. Uh, Latin writing inside lid. I can't read Latin. Incident. Missing child. Cause of incident. Unknown. Possible kidnapping or runaway. Description. Eight-year-old Brax Milton was reported missing today. The parents said he was last seen in his room playing with his toys. When they went to check on him, he was gone. A strange box was left on his bed. The box looks like a very old version of a jack-in-the-box toy. It doesn't appear to be in a working condition. Inside the box was a small doll and some strange writing on the lid. It also has the letters Weasel inscribed on the inside bottom. The box has been taken in as evidence, along with a few other items, and will be checked for fingerprints. Parents do not know where... Go away. 
Look at your back. Okay, bye. Please go away. Mama. Greta. Break room. I thought that was something standing there. Research office too. Ah. Examination. So all these are just relating to the story of Emily wants to play. I think I'm probably going to cut all those out. Okay. So what are these? Well, here's another message to myself. I'll clean it again today, as usual. What is that? What was Emily. that? Emily. What was that? Emily. Answer me. What was that? I hate seeing Emily this way. She used to love to play games. Tag tatters. And now, oh, okay, so he say a word. plays a different game then. Oh, key card. Perfect, okay. Crew. Oh my god! Oh. She's going the way I need to go. No minor under the age of 18. Other minors over the age of 18? Time to go. Time to go. I have level 2 security clearance, so I did have to go the other way. So in what color is... I have to get to green. Okay. I'm not sprinting because I'm pretty sure that makes... Way more noise. Okay. So I'm close to green. Nine AM. Well, I think. This might be a good time to end off this video. If you guys enjoyed it, please like and subscribe. Uh, part 2 coming soon. Well, see ya.